Good morning. Good morning. Today I invited Kevin back to worship for Good Shepherd Sunday. Today we get to remember that Jesus cares for us and loves us, much like shepherds love their sheep. Kevin, I wanted to know, did you have a shepherd that cared for you when you were on the farm? I loved growing up on the farm. We had a pasture with a fence to protect us and keep us safe. We had lots of food and our hooves were checked regularly. We even had good haircuts. The shepherd, I think, was the person who owned the farm, always seemed to watch out for us and make sure nothing bad happened to us. He provided shelter when it stormed and kept others that were dangerous away from us. He gave us lots of attention. When I left the farm, I was nervous because I was afraid that no one would, would watch out for me like the shepherd did. But when I got to St. Paul's, a lot of people different have helped me. Yes, Kevin, when you were on that farm, you were part of a herd of sheep that was cared for by a shepherd or the farmer. That person loved you and didn't run away when danger came. Instead, they figured out how to keep your entire herd and all the animals on the farm safe. Did you know that Jesus is like a shepherd? Shepherds guide and protect their flocks, making sure that all sheep like you are cared for. Jesus is like a shepherd because he protects us, he shows us love, and he cares for us. By dying on the cross, Jesus shows us that like shepherds, he would do anything to care for us and love us. But that's not all, Kevin. Jesus doesn't want you to be alone and doesn't want any of us to be alone. Jesus invites us into a big family that cares for and loves each other, like here at St. Paul's. So just like you were never alone on the farm, you're never alone here with us. We hope that you will continue to feel loved and grow in your faith while you were with us here at St. Paul's. Oh, I'm thankful that I found St. Paul's. I don't know where I would be if you didn't help me way back in December. I felt so lost and alone, but now I feel like I have lots of friends that help care for me every day. I'm just starting to understand Jesus' love for me, but I'm thankful to know that Jesus always loves me. That's great, Kevin, and I hope that all of us here continue to learn how Jesus loves us and cares for us. Let us pray. God, we give thanks for the ways that you bring us into family together, for drawing us closer to you, for protecting us and loving us like shepherds love their sheep. Be with us this week. Guide us and help us to show your love to others. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Bye, Kevin.